We are here this morning in this uh, be beautiful venue of Kloster Mühle with our leadership seminar, um, Philosophy and Practice of Aspen, Germany. And I'm here with one of our participants. And um, I would like to start by handing over the mic to you. And maybe you can tell us a little bit about who you are and what you do. Hello, my, Genia, uh, my name is Zhenya Moore. And uh, I come originally from Ukraine, from Kiev, but I am based in Berlin at the moment. And uh, uh, my background is brand strategy and uh, marketing. And I worked, I built my whole career in the big corporation, including lovely Coca-Cola and uh, advertising agencies such as McCann. Um, but since the war started, I founded my own NGO called Real Life Ukraine uh, that unites university students from Ukraine and from European universities in their efforts to um, work on the projects jointly to rebuild Ukraine better than it was before. Uh, and it's mostly focused on small cities and small communities. Thank you so much for being here and taking time out of your very busy schedule. Um, and you're doing amazing work with your um, NGO and with your initiative. Um, what made you decide to come to our leadership seminar and take the time out of your busy schedule? Uh, it was actually, thank you for the honor for ha having me here. And it was a um, lovely invitation. And uh, I immediately had idea that I really need this. First of all, because I would like to reunite with the community of the leaders, which is essential for what I do, for to feel the support and to feel kind of a vibe. Um, and uh, second, I, I had a lot of um, information about Aspen Germany that is actually amazing organization and the seminars that you run are very useful and very um, kind of changing the people's attitude towards leaders' attitude towards uh, their activities. So. <laughs> um, and you participated in a group which is, which is pretty international. Um, and you did some reading of philosophy, you did practical parts. Um, what do you think are you taking away for your daily life from the seminar? Uh, the most um, amazing thing that I discovered during the seminar, how the ancient text actually correlate or correspond with today. That is something that we all have to remember, that despite the circumstances, despite the history moves on, um, not very much change, and we have to look at the wisdom that has been developed during the humankind. Yeah. <laughs> And um, leadership in these times is not easy, right? With all those uncertainties and the pressures. Um, how do you cope as being a leader? Or let, let me ask differently, what makes a good leader from your standpoint? Oh. <laughs> I think the good leader is someone who has a vision and who has a purpose. And we actually talked about this for a long time in the seminar. It's like multiple times we approach this from different angles from the different texts and i think this purpose actually that drives me at the moment because it would be probably easier for me to continue my career but i have decided to completely change and do something meaningful and that gives me a purpose Thank you very, very much for being with us, for doing what you do, um, putting so much effort um, into rebuilding Ukraine. Um, and uh, yeah, thank you so much for sharing your insights and your wisdom with us. Thank you very much again. <laughs> and um, I would like to thank the whole group and the whole organization, the, and especially the moderators who are actually amazingly lead us through this not easy task. Thank you, Stormy. Thank you. Thank you.